Michel Barnier has issued a stark warning to European businesses for them to prepare for inevitable changes after the end of the Brexit transition period. The EU's chief negotiator said firms and citizens have just five months to prepare for Britain leaving the bloc's single market and customs union. The Frenchman said, the Brexit transition ends on December 31. In five months, the UK leaves the EU's single market and customs union. Changes are inevitable, with or without an agreement on the new partnership. Companies and citizens must get ready. The European Commission has issued a 39-page dossier of preparations businesses and citizens needs to make before the end of the year. It gives advice for future changes to the trading relationship with Britain and travel changes for holiday makers. Member states are warned that choices made by Boris Johnson in pushing to deviate from EU rules and opting not to extend the transition period beyond December meant, inevitable disruptions, will occur next year. This would, risk compounding the pressure that businesses are already under due to the COVID-19 outbreak. The, get ready for changes, memo insisted it was, essential that all stakeholders, start preparing for, far-reaching changes. The communication advised all businesses to consider revisiting their existing preparedness plans for no deal Brexit as they are still very relevant. Mr Johnson's push for a bare bones agreement with Brussels mean firms must implement these changes whether the European Union and the United Kingdom agree on an ambitious new partnership by December 31, 2020 or not the dossier says. The wrangling over a free trade agreement have broken up for a short summer break still with significant differences in position between the UK and EU. David Frost, the Prime Minister's Brexit envoy, will resume talks with EU counterpart Mr Barnier in Brussels on August 17. They have also agreed to hold further rounds of negotiations in September and October. The battles over future access to Britain's fishing grounds and the so-called level playing field remain the toughest challenges for the pair, according to European sources. One EU official said, there's much left to solve for August, we need to get somewhere meaningful on fish and the level playing field.